Hello everyone, it's James Chamberlain, and today I've got a little bit of a more personal video for you guys that, despite it being on kind of a boring topic to talk about, I think you guys may actually end up enjoying. Today I'm going to be walking you guys through a day of my life. I think that a lot of people are going to find this to be quite interesting, and I'm sure that there are at least some of you out there who are curious what I do every day and what my routine is. So today I'll be showing you guys from when I wake up in the morning all the way to when I go to bed. So I hope you guys end up enjoying this video, and let's get started. All right, so normally I wake up at around 7 to 8 a.m. in the morning. Sometimes I'll wake up a little bit earlier, but usually it's around 7 to 8. And from there, the first thing I always do when I start off my day is I read my Fruits of the Spirit. Once I'm done reading my fruits, normally while I'm still actually lying in bed, I'll go ahead and pull out my laptop and I'll check my DMs, see if anybody tried to contact me, and sometimes check my YouTube channel, see how that's going. Once I've checked that, I'll usually get up, do my morning routine, and just game for a little bit, play Roblox for a little bit, play around for half an hour to an hour. I also, depending on whether I have a video project going on or not, I might edit some video as well in the morning when I'm really feeling creative inspiration, and I really just feel like creating something cool for you guys to see. All right, so now that I played around a little bit, I will come here outside and I will feed the animals. I will feed Chip my donkey as well as my goat and the sheep. They both eat hay, of course, so we're gonna go ahead and get them some of that. So I'll just go ahead and speed along through this part. We'll give them a scoop and a half of pelt for the goat and the sheep. And now they need to eat some hay, so we're gonna give them about a full bucket over here. Alrighty, now for Chip here, he eats a lot more than the goat and sheep do. So they, he actually needs, so we actually need the wheelbarrow to fill him. And he actually eats a whole flake, which is kind of like a chunk off a bale of hay. And he eats one for breakfast and one for dinner. So let's go ahead and deliver that. Now it's time to do the fun part. We're gonna clean up the poop. That's actually really easy. That's actually much easier than doing the water and doing all of that stuff. So let's get started on that. This only takes a couple minutes. Now on some days I have to fill his water, but today isn't one of them, tomorrow will be. I either scoop the poop or I do the water, it's one or the other depending on which day it is. So today we're doing the poop, tomorrow's gonna be the water.
Once the animals have been fed and all of that important stuff has been done, then I go ahead and get ready for my school day. And I first of all start by going ahead and writing out a schedule for what I think I'm going to be doing during the day so that I have a layout of my plans and what I want to get done. So guys, we're finally ready to set up the lab. We had a little bit of technical issues, but now we are ready to go. All right, so we need to use the measuring spoon and put our neon sulfate in. Into the beaker. There's about one. Glad. Two, there we go, two milliliters. Filled up to 125, so that's almost to the top. There we go, 125. Next, I hope this is the right pivot. So it's completely dissolved. out here, bud. Sorry. Negative turn. Alright, now I got the fun part. I'm going to connect the batteries. And we're going to go ahead and see. Oh, they wrapped it in plastic. That's fantastic. Oh, you know what? I'm going to unwrap it like this. I should have seen that they had a thing for unwrapping it. negative terminal is producing the most. This reminds me of like those bubbling Christmas lights you see and that's probably almost exactly what this reaction is there. There you go. Oh, it blew up so I'd say we got it good. There we go, I'd say that's a successful experiment. Now, I'm not gonna bore you guys with writing up the information and writing up the results, but I hope you enjoyed watching that part. It is now lunchtime. So normally for lunch, what I'll do is I'll either, if I'm doing schoolwork, normally I'll just take a break and watch some YouTube while I have my lunch and lie on my bed and watch that on the laptop. Or I'll go ahead and while I'm working here, editing a video, or sometimes even doing schoolwork, I'll just have some lunch at my desk. And today I'm having fish sticks. So let's get started and have lunch. I'm actually going to go ahead and start editing the beginning of this video while I have my lunch just to pass the time a little bit quicker. So let's get started doing that. Let's begin by editing the video. guys now in case you didn't know I love music I love playing it and listening to it and sometimes in between periods of school or just when I'm bored and want a recreational activity to do I absolutely love to play my organ I'm still learning so I'm not the greatest but I'll go ahead and let you guys take a listen and hear me play just a little bit
All right, it's midday now. It's about three o'clock, and it's time to give Chip a little bit of snack as well as the mule, just a little snack for them because they do get a little bit hungry in the middle of the day. So we're gonna go ahead and give them their snack. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and let Chip out too so that he can go ahead and eat his snack out here with her because he really enjoys time out of his corral and actually getting to walk around the yard a little bit. For the people who can't tell the difference between a mule and a donkey, this is a mule right here. Her name is Gracie, and she is our mule, and right over there is Chip, my donkey. If you guys can tell, there is quite a size difference there. Whenever we're out here, of course, Kibo can never stop chewing his ball. He's always doing that. He's just out here watching the animals. Today's gonna be an especially fun day. I wanna go ahead and get some footage of them. So I'm gonna try and send the drone up and see if that's even possible or not. You always know it's gonna be an exciting day when I try to deal with flying the drone because I am terrible at it and the drone itself just is not very good. It appears to have a mind of its own. Now, I have actually never ever done drone footage in one of my videos. I'm literally not even on the controls, and there the drone is up there just flying around in the sky. I'm not even touching the controls. It's doing that, and I'm not even touching the controls. And it just crashed. All right, guys, it's late afternoon now. It's around 4 o'clock, and we're going to be taking the mule for a walk now. And it's always nice to get out of the house in some sort of a way. So let's go ahead and take the mule for a walk. Right, guys we just made it back from our walk and we're back up here in the corral area again and it's about time to feed the animals again this time their dinner meal so I'm gonna get ready to do that I already showed you feeding breakfast so I'm not really gonna show you guys feeding the dinner it's just the exact same thing push the wheelbarrow up there and give it to them I love spending time out here with chip and just with the animals it's always nice getting to spend time with them they're so adorable no, aside from chores and stuff, I'm completely done with all my work for today. So you guys might wonder what I do when I'm just on free time. And one thing I'll do is I'll play. Um, sometimes I end up just making videos when I get like creative, inspirational ideas. But another thing that I absolutely love to do, because I love getting out of the house and I love exploring, is I love to take my bicycle or my golf cart out and just cruise around the neighborhood on these dirt roads. It's really, really fun. And believe it or not, right now, both of those vehicles are having some issues the bike the wheel fell off for some reason and the golf cart has a leaking differential which during this Christmas break I'm gonna go ahead and get around to fixing that but I did get some super great footage of it a while ago cruising around the neighborhood that I'll go ahead and play for you guys Yeah, I'm
Alright guys, it is definitely night time. It is completely pitch black outside now. And I just had my dinner, had some pizza for dinner, and finished up editing the rest of this video. I try to get to bed at around 9 o'clock, so I'm definitely going to go to bed right after this clip. I hope you guys enjoyed this little look inside of my life. If you did, please leave a like and maybe even subscribe. Thank you so much for watching everyone, and goodbye.